it's Meg. Um, I'm here learning how to draw blood. I'm here with um, my friend, Dr. Rufin. Hi. <laughs> it's extra gay. Um, Dan has been a doctor for 26 hours now, so he feels fully prepared to teach me how to draw his blood from his veins. Um, okay, so this is a tourniquet. I'm going to wrap it. Okay, higher. I'm gonna wrap it higher. Yeah. All right. Oh, cool, look, that one's popping. Okay, and then I see his vein popping. <laughs> yep, you can see it from there. Um, okay, so now I'm going to wipe it with alcohol. Are you nervous? No. Not even nervous? No, I trust me. Okay, you got a little summer in there. All right. And now I'm going to open the butterfly needle, is what we call it, as doctors? Yeah. Okay, the butterfly needle. The nurses usually use it more than we do. Okay, whatever. Okay. And I'm going to un... Oh. Twist. Okay. Needle. All right, and I put the long end down farther and right into that big vein right there. Oh, no, no, not get it. There you go. I see a little bit of blood. Oh, that's more. Okay. That's good, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And now I'm going to put it into the vial. Do we call it vials? Yeah. Is vial a creepy name for it? Look at it go! Oh my god, it's going so fast. <laughs> Look, okay, I know. I'm just trying to show all of my fans. Um, okay, okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Should I, should I just no, press the button? Pull that out. Oh, pull this out first. Okay. Okay, pull it out and then I press the button. Mm -hmm. <gasps> okay, look, I got you gauze this time. Thanks, so. Okay, yeah. I put the gauze on. Okay, and what? Oh, the tourniquet. Okay, so now I drew blood, um, and I have biohazards now that I'll put on my biohazard bed. But um, okay, success! Coming to you, Africa.